Hey everyone, I'm Nina Zeta with Sidewalker Daily, and in today's video, I wanna talk about how to make money on Instagram. I think a lot of people are often wondering, okay, how do I use this like network to actually make money, right? Now, I know the people that are watching this video, if you are part of my ride or die Sidewalker family, chances are you're either an influencer or a creator or maybe a brand that wants to work with influencers, because that's what I talk about on my channel, influencer marketing and social media. Um, so a lot of you guys probably are like, okay, I want to use Instagram strategically. I want to use it to make money. What are some things that I can be doing? So this video is going to be generic in the sense that it's going to be both for my brands and my influencers because I want to help you guys think of ways to start making money on the platform. Before I get into everything, if you are new to the channel and haven't subscribed yet, hit that little subscribe button, hit the little bell so you can be up to date on all things influencer marketing and social media. Okay, let's go ahead and jump in. So the first thing I think that I don't see enough businesses doing, and I'm talking like major, big, humongo businesses, is setting up their Instagram shop. This is a missed opportunity. If you sell online and you don't have, if you sell a physical product, excuse me, and you have an e-commerce store, then why not have an Instagram shop? I'm gonna leave a link below um, if you are a business and don't have your shop to see, so you guys can check out your eligibility requirements um, and to show you how you can get started setting up a shop ASAP. Um, to be frank, I think that right now they're only doing physical products. They're not doing like digital products. So it's really for businesses that have something to sell. Why not let Instagram like sell it for you? And I did a, read, uh, blah, blah, a video recently on like shopping from Instagram Reels, right? So like a lot of us know Instagram Reels are so big right now. This video covers like how you can shop on Reels um, and how you can tag your products now on Instagram Reels and how that can help revolutionize your business. So if you don't have a shop yet, set one up. And same for my influencer clients. I know a lot of you guys have swag or have a little, like an e-commerce store of selling your own things. Um, maybe some of you are approved partners for other businesses and you can then tag the products that make them shoppable in your caption. I have seen that happen when you are an approved partner. You don't have your own um, shop, but you're promoting other product um, from approved partners. So that's definitely something that influencers may want to consider. Now, I think when it comes to making money on Instagram, the low hanging fruit, the thing that so many influencers do is reach out to brands for brand partnerships. Now, a quote that has stayed with me forever, um, Claire Silmers from Fashion Bomb Daily, she mentioned it on one of our group coaching calls for our guest speaker. And she was just like, closed mouths don't get fed. And it just really resonated because it's true. If you are an influencer, use it as an opportunity to pitch to brands and, you know, literally find out what it is that they need. Maybe they don't need your influence. Maybe they need content. I see so many brands on Instagram that don't have reels yet, that don't have IGTV yet on their own channels. So maybe that's a place for you to come in and pitch that idea. Now, if you are an influencer or creator that is still on the fence, hasn't been pitching, literally pitching is my thing. It is what I get high off of. I love pitching. So I'm going to leave a link below to work with me and I can help you develop your pitching strategy and find the exact way for you to get in and pitch. Um, but of course, brand partnerships, securing brand partnerships is a great way to monetize off Instagram. And again, sometimes brands come to you for influence, which is when you have strong, you know, numbers, media, you're basically considered media, right? So you can help get them that visibility, that reach, that brand awareness. And then sometimes they need you for content creation. So that can be a really good signal for you on figuring out what you want to pitch. So if you're not ready to start pitching to brands and you're not ready, you know, maybe, or maybe you are ready. I think affiliate marketing is another thing that we're seeing tons of on Instagram now. And what's interesting is Instagrammers are doing it like for themselves, right? So like, let's just say they post like a shirt, they're wearing an outfit or drinking from a coffee mug. Like they're like affiliate links. They sign up to be an affiliate through whether it's a third party platform like Commission Junction or they're working with the brand directly. I had an influencer recently um, reach out to a brand and ask them like, hey, do you have an affiliate program? Like, can I have a code? I'd love to like promote your product and get a commission of the sales. And the brand was like, no, we don't have one, but we'd love to work something out. So that's also a creative way to pitch is pitching yourself to be an affiliate affiliate. Um, and obviously being an affiliate is one of the ways that you can make money on Instagram. And for my brand clients, if you haven't set up an affiliate program yet, 
maybe that's something you guys should also consider. Um, for those that are using affiliates, you know, I think what we're starting to see is, of course, like Instagram doesn't let you have links yet. So we're seeing a lot of like the link in bio. Um, people are doing swipe ups on their stories and linking it to their affiliates. And um, we're going to start seeing like this is just something that's just now common play right on Instagram is using affiliate marketing to make money. Now, the third way um, that people are using Instagram to make money is through IGTV. Now, as you can see on these headlines, Instagram announced that they're going to be rolling ads on IGTV. So this is to say just like how YouTube has ads running and creators can monetize the ads. We're going to see the same thing roll out on Instagram. Instagram is going to have IGTV content and there's going to be ads and the creator is going to be able to monetize off of those ads. So influencers, um, if you have YouTube style video, you are going to want to start consider rolling this over onto your IGTV. Or if you don't even have a YouTube yet and you're creating long form video content, 15 minutes or under, then that can go on IGTV too. And when it starts to finally roll out and you're able to monetize on it, you're going to be setting yourself up for success. And I do have a video on how Instagram creators can monetize and start making money. And you can watch that here. Now, another way creators are making money on Instagram is through going live and they're setting up their badges. Um, if you are interested in going live or you like to go live on Instagram, now you can start to monetize off of it. So basically what a badge does is it lets the person watching your live basically tip you. They can buy a badge to support you and to support the content. Now, what ends up happening when you go on a live and someone buys a badge, it shows up like you'll be like, oh, this person bought a badge. So this is where you as the creator shout that person out maybe make them feel special and that could encourage other people to support you via live stream and i think it's interesting to see like while it may sound like small you know it's pennies at first because the badges are not very expensive you know it's just helping you think creatively about oh like these are the different ways i can start to monetize on instagram now we spoke about this earlier briefly when we talked about like working with brands as a brand sponsor. Um, but I did just want to say like when you're selling content, if you use your Instagram as a portfolio, um, this can be really helpful for when you are pitching content services to brands and you're going to them and you're saying, Oh, like I want to shoot your this, that, the other, I want to create content for you. And your Instagram is a portfolio of that content. This can become a really good recipe for success in pitching content content. So I think one of the other ways it's natural for Instagram because it's such a visual platform, it's such a photo driven platform is to sell photo services and to sell video services or real services, you know, and I say real services because people need reels, like they need those reels, even stories, graphics, people need that type of content. And if you can produce that, that's how you can start monetizing your Instagram as a creator because now you're saying, hey, I can do these assets for you. Now, one of the ways that we love monetizing our Instagram is through consulting. So we basically, our Instagram shows our brand clients like what we're capable of doing for them. Um, similarly, how I talked about the portfolio for my photos, my photographers and my videographers, it can be the same thing on the client side. So using Instagram to showcase your consulting work is gonna help you monetize. So while you're not making money on Instagram, you're making money from Instagram. That's literally how we got into this business. We grew Sidewalker Daily, we developed it, then brands started, started taking notice of what we were doing and they would come to us as an influencer and we were like, no, we don't want to be influencers. We want to help you develop really big campaigns and really big projects. So that's how we were able to use our Instagram to make money. Another way we're seeing creators um, promote themselves on Instagram. And I'm not sure if you guys have seen this is literally like they are promoting their Patreon, they're promoting their cash app, their Venmo, like people are basically now starting to ask for tips. They're like, I create content all the time. If you want to support me and my content, buy me a coffee, you know, or, you know, here's my cash app, here's my Venmo. And I have literally heard of cases where influencers are being paid a random like one of our clients was like oh yeah someone just sent me like two hundred dollars because he was like so grateful for like the content i made like he was like on me no strings attached so it was like oh my gosh like people actually do this is this a way that you want to make money on instagram have you tried it how do you feel about it um up for discussion let me know in the comments i'd love to hear what you guys think now i wanted to say that i've seen a lot of influencers do this and i think it's interesting so instead of working with brands in a typical like you give me a product i shoot it i post about it they're working with brands in a different way like as an advertising channel so like a brand will send an influencer the creative 
they'll send them the copy, they'll send them the, like a flyer and this po person will post this on their feed or on their stories or like whatever. And then they'll archive it after 24, 48 hours. So it's more like an ad. Um, and it's less, and it's because, and the reason I say it's an ad because the influencer cre is not creating the content, the brand is providing it. So this is also a way I've seen a lot of my influencers create because they able, they're able to price it cheaper instead of saying, okay, like this is the work that it would take for me to shoot it. They're like, oh yeah, you can just use my like influence and pay me for, um, to promote content that you guys have already made. So something for you guys to consider. So I hope this gave you guys some ideas of how to use Instagram to make money. As always, if you need a little bit of one-on-one, -on -one, click the link below to book a call with me. We can figure it out, whether you're on the brand side or creator side, we can really get down to your monetization um, and how you plan to use Instagram to make money and you know make money and have it as an actual business and not a hobby. That's my specialty is helping my clients turn it from hobby to business. So if you wanna work together, I'll leave that link. As always, um, leave me a comment. Let me know what are other ways that you guys are using to using Instagram to monetize. Um, I love hearing from you guys. Leave the comment. I go through all of them myself and it gives us fuel to keep going and pushing through on this channel and creating content for you guys. Um, so yeah, if you guys enjoyed this video, make sure you hit subscribe to our channel and I will see you in the next video.